Good morning, Mike here from Paradise Shots. Today we're going to be talking about strainers. Strainers are found on your engines and on your air conditioning systems. You have to clean these things on a routine basis, about every 30 days or so, depending upon your water, and clean them out. We're going to show you how to okay, do it today. today we're, going to, we're going to clean the strainer that's most difficult on this boat to get to. It's under our, our master stateroom bunk right here, so let's take this thing apart and we'll get to it. Okay, we've got the the mattress pulled out so we can access our system down here. Three components that we're looking at here. We've got a through hole fitting right there. We'll need to close that momentarily. There's our actual strainer itself. That's where the basket lies. And there's our water pump that pushes water up to the air conditioning system. So we're going to get in there and we're going to start taking this thing apart and show you how it works. But before we get to work, we'll need to shut off our system. So let's just go ahead and disengage our heating system right Okay, now. the first thing we're going to need to do is, is close our through hole fitting. So you can see this valve here. You know it's open right now because of the, the way the handle is, is positioned. So we're going to turn that down here 90 degrees. So we've got it all closed. Now we can go over here and remove the basket from this strainer. You'll get a little water leakage here, but nothing to really be concerned about. Now inside you will find a basket. Okay. Basket collects dirt, um, any kind of debris. There's some in there you can see that we've caught. Uh, this has been in here about 30 days. We like to change these out about every 30 days or so. But that's going to be dependent upon your local areas and how how uh, nutrient um, rich your water really is. Okay, we've got a clean strainer basket here. We like to keep a spare around just because it makes it quicker to, to service. We're going to put these bromine tablets in here. There's about three of them in this basket right here. These tablets help keep critters from growing inside of the air conditioning heating system itself. Here in Florida we'll get uh, barnacles, uh, even little crabs will get up in there and they will they will form a home in there. These bromine tablets basically uh, treat the system if you will so they uh, they do not make it in there. So we're going to put this new basket back in here. Put our cover back on. Tighten it down firmly, okay, and open our through hole back open, and we should be good to go. Okay, there's one more aspect of this system that I'd like to share with you as well, is that this incoming line right here will on occasion get plugged up with dirt and grass. You can get grass growing in here to a point where it actually shuts down about 50% of your water flow. As we've said before, heating and air conditioning systems on a boat, um, anytime you have a problem, about 98% of the time it's a, a water issue. So if you're not getting a good water flow after you change your strainer, take off this line, look at it, see what you've got in there. Uh, you may need to take and clean it out with a water hose or a, or a snake or something like that. Okay, let's turn the system back up and see how everything runs. Okay, we've got water pumped on down here. I hear water flowing through it. We should be good to go. The AC just kicked on, so we are we are good for another 30 days. Thanks for stopping by. Hope you learned something today. See you later.